I just think people are a bit thicker and selfish now, aren't they, genuinely? People are thick as shit now, aren't they? <laughs> Self-centered. <sighs> I'm thick as shit! <laughs> thick people used to hide, didn't they? <laughs> You've never met many thick people. They should be hidden, didn't they? Don't let them out as thick. Take him home, he's thick. Take her home, thick as shit. <laughs> now, nah, they come on the telly. Hey! I'm thick as shit! <laughs> Where's Africa? <laughs> oh, fuck you, that can't even read. <laughs> and I'm not talking about the people on these Benefit Street programmes, these Channel 5 fuckers make, you know, where they claim they're making a serious documentary about modern Britain. There's a man here on a tyre at half eleven in the morning <laughs> with a can of cider. Oh, my God. <laughs> and I watch those shows and think... I want to live on that street. <laughs> That's the street for me. I wonder if White D's got a spare room going. Huh? There's a show on TV now, drives me up the wall. It's called Eat Well For Less. This is a show for people who don't know how to go shopping. How to go shopping? We're spending too much on their shopping. This is the show. They've got the lovely Greg Wallace on there. We love Greg, top man. He's there like that, he's there, Greg. Whoa. He's got a bit of a sidekick. Savvy, the sidekick. He's got all the stats. He goes, Greg, thousands of families in the UK at the moment spiralling into debt because they're spending too much on their shopping. Greg's like, you're fucking joking! <laughs> Let me drink all this custard and we'll go and sort it out, all right? <laughs> and he drinks a whole bucket of custard. Whoa, 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 be lovely, whee! <laughs> He's proper fired up now. He goes cheering down the street. Come on, let's sort it out! He goes walking down the street, let's sort it out! He gets to this woman's house and he rings on the bell. She comes, he goes, get out of me way, you! He just goes in the house and he looks in the cupboard. He goes, oh, fuck off, will ya? <laughs> six packets of pasta in one cupboard. Who needs six packets of pasta? <laughs> She's like, I know, Greg, we're out of control, babe. We're out of control. <laughs> and what am I? I'm a gluten free by choice. <laughs> There's a dozy old man over in the background and he's like that. <sighs> Greg says, why don't you say something when she spends all this money? Oh, I don't want to upset her, Greg. Oh, I don't want to upset her. There's the kids. Are you going to help us, Mr. Wallace? We ain't had no shoes for two years. <laughs> she spends it all on seven for it's and bingo. <laughs> he says, right, let's shoot it out. Let's shoot it in. Let's go shopping. He takes them to the shops, right? Come on, let's go shopping. And they go shopping, they do a weekly shop. Because you're right, let's go home. It's good, let's go home. Get up. And they go home. They put the shopping out on the table. This is the breakthrough moment. This is where everything changes. This is what the license fee's all about. This is what it's for. He picks up a yogurt, right? Own brand. He says to the family, You see these? They taste the same, but they cost less. The family erupt at this information. The wife starts crying, I can't believe it! They taste the same and they cost less! Oh, what sort of a man have I been? <laughs> the old man's punching the kitchen door. They taste the same and they cost less! They taste the same and they cost less! I've let everyone down! <laughs> the kids are dancing around the table. Oh, they taste the same and they cost less! Neighbours are banging on the wall. What's all this? They taste the same and they cost less. Why do we hear about this? African neighbour comes to the window. They taste the same. But they cost less. I don't believe it. What they bagging? I don't know where he is.
where he came from. I was starting to worry that Mr. Ahmed was looking like a token. All right? So, so I followed an African mate for him. For a bit of balance. If I can just find something for the traveller community, we're coming. So Greg, right, he says to this family, look, if you lot take on board all my advice, every month you can save three pound. <laughs> you could have holiday. You could go camping. <laughs> can you imagine that show getting made in the 1970s? Some urban knocking on my mum's door. Hello, Mrs. Flanagan, I'm from the BBC. We were wondering if we could make a show that makes you look like you're thick as shit. <laughs> Oh, was ya? Cop for that. <laughs> now fuck off, you Oxbridge cunt. <laughs> bit strong, Mick, bit strong. <laughs> are you out or were you out? 